All right, Jason, <clears throat> I thought you might need some little help, so I decided to uh, record some of my action so you can see just how they do it in the pros. Look at that, you're number five on my list. See, look at this. All right, I like your little move of frustration taking out on those guys. I don't really do that, but that sounds like a great stress reliever, and I may have to adopt it. I really hope this works out since I don't have a uh, little recording device. But we'll see. <clears throat> yeah, I'm just kind of letting the first little run here speak for itself. Do 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 do. Oh. Nope. 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 Oh. <laughs> well, I beat everything you did in that video on my first little go here. Oh, I'm almost up to your high score. <laughs> Just saying, you know. You got a little ways to go. Oh! Well, I beat it on the first try. <sighs> yep, by about a million. Not bad. <laughs> Alright, I'll give you a little breakdown of some of the techniques that I use and see if you think I'm being an idiot or what. Anyhow, there's a couple things that when Eddie and I were doing the arms race of uh, Geometry Wars that I would try. First would be collect the geomes at all costs, like this, you know, I'll go through, get them lined up, or die, like that. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyway, just blast them, collect all the geomes before I would even focus on the next gate, and that would be a lot of looping around the enemies quite a bit. I mean, obviously you can't do this, shit, you can't do this the entire time, um, but I've gotten up to about like 200-ish geomes before I've lost the first one. <coughs> um, another tactic that I like, this one is kind of fun, it's a little stress reliever, it's not going to win any uh, contests, but it's just destroy the gates at all costs which can help when it gets really crowded which is where uh, I came up with this thing like as soon as I would see a gate I would try and get rid of it because those things are bastards <clears throat> that's like an ultra like pacifism version of pacifism Man, this game is great. Ooh, right there brings up a little, little helpful pointer. <laughs> I'm sounding like a real ass in this, and this is awesome. I don't mind. <laughs> but when you're going for a really close call into a gate with a bunch of enemies that are right around you, um. It's best to go for the corner because the explosion that comes from the gates travels outwards from the orange parts and it's not instantaneous. So if you're just shooting through the middle, that's the last part right at the gate that's going to explode. Um, so there's a chance that you could be through the gate but still die from an enemy that's right on it. Um, so like if it's going to be a close call and if you have any sort of say in it, go for the edge because the explosion will happen instantly right there. <laughs> um, that's about it. I'm just pleased that I beat your high score on the very first try. <laughs> uh, 
uh, that's all I really cared about. I just wanted to get it done in less than 10 minutes. Um, <laughs> cause I'm an asshole. <laughs> uh, but bring it on. I welcome a healthy challenge. I haven't had a challenge since, uh, Eagle Sniffer there. <clears throat> yep, 231 million. Alright, well, good luck, Jason. <laughs>